hello, 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 everyone. Hello, YouTubers. It's Anonymous T. Hope you're having an amazing day today. So today we're talking Love and Mary Transville. Today we are talking about this alleged, you know, mean girl click, this alleged mean girl alliance that is, you know, down to try to take down Melody Shree, you guys. And I just want to know what the point is. What is the point and what do you think that you are accomplishing at this point? You guys do not like each other, but you are willing to be friends for the sake of dragging Melody Shree in hopes that you can get her kicked off of her own show. Make it make sense, you guys. Make it make sense. You should be thanking Melody Shree for giving you an opportunity to even be on the show and receive a check for the show. And instead, these people are trying to pull what Mary to Medicine did to Mariah on Bravo, you guys, and try to band together and try to get Melody Sheree kicked off and try to band together and try to make Melody Sheree the issue while not holding themselves accountable, you guys. Not holding themselves accountable. How are you Melody Sheree's friend if you are running everything Melody Sheree tells you back to Martel so that he can plot and he can continue to cheat and do all of these other schemes, you guys? How are you, Melody Sheree's friend, and Melody Sheree helped you get connected to become a member of the Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated and get you to network with some other people for different opportunities of some movers and shakers that she knew and for you to turn around and completely, you know, out details about Martel's mistress at the beginning of the show and do all of this taunting and then bring your mother on to continue the taunting and saying the things that you are afraid to say on camera, but yet decide to also befriend all of the people that Melody Shree is no longer cool with, even though you don't like them either in real life, you guys. Make it make sense that these are the people that are claiming to, you know, be above it all, uh, claiming to be the bigger person, claiming to be a person with morals and values, character and integrity, but you are willing to go to the bottom of the barrel. You are willing to be friends with the enemy and become the enemies in hopes that you are going to try to take somebody down. And it doesn't matter the kind of edit on the show that you get. It doesn't matter how many Instagram lives that you do trying to say, oh, they didn't show everything or the show is edited and blah, 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 blah. We know the truth, you guys. We know the truth. We know what this game is. We know what the shenanigans are. We are plugged in. So you do not have to try to twist things around and make it seem like we are all on planet delusion, you guys. We know the truth. We know the tea. We know what's really going on. And it's just so crazy to me that people, and even you can hear in the background, you guys, of these lives, of these people still talking mess in between breaks of filming this reunion, you guys. And that's how you know People are not happy in their lives, you guys. People are not happy in their lives that you are so riled up over one person that you don't even have the decency to have any empathy or to care in the world about the things that are being said about them, about the way that they are being treated on this show, that they gave you an opportunity to be on, that you are so in your hate, in your feelings, in your jealousy about this person, that all you can do, instead of being a friend to them, you are being a hater. Make it make sense, you guys. Make it make sense. But again, Melody Sheree continues to come out on top. Melody Sheree is the one who continues to be blessed. Melody Sheree is the one that the people want. And there's nothing you can do about it, you guys. There is nothing you can do about it. And time and time again, we see Melody Sheree rise above. And, and that's all that this is going to be, you guys. That's all this is going to be. And um, so I will wait again to see what happens this reunion. But I have a feeling, once again, people, are, again, are going to try to make their behavior about Melody Sheree. And it's like she doesn't control you guys and she is not having this hold over you guys. You guys are willingly choosing to make Melody Sheree the enemy and thinking that if you form these alliances that that's going to make the viewers think, oh, Melody Sheree is a really bad person. Melody Sheree is not friends with these people anymore. Maybe the issue is her. How about maybe the issue is you? 
that you have a mother who is willing to say anything about anybody and their children and do anything for a check, do anything for laughs on social media, and you have no care in the world, and even when things escalate to violence, you still don't care. You still don't care at all. And you don't say, I don't condone violence. You don't say, I don't condone what my mother said. Instead, you feed into it and you blame other people. You take no accountability for your actions. You take no accountability on behalf of your mother's actions. And you double down on it. So what does that say about you? How is Melody Cherie the problem in that moment where your actions and your mother's actions is what led to all this drama in the first place? Make it make sense. So let me know what you guys think. What do you guys think in the comments about this alleged alliance, you guys? And, and again, this isn't even new. This isn't even new news, you guys. There's always been people trying to form alliances against Melody Cherie, you guys. There has always been tension with Melody Cherie and some of these other women on the show, you guys, because they're jealous, because they think that they can kick Melody Shree off the show and do all these shenanigans. This isn't new. This is not new information, you guys. Uh, but again, it's just resurfacing because we have the filming of the reunion this weekend. And, you know, it's one of the rare times that we see the cast all being together at this point because of their being so much division and tension and everything else that is going on. Um, so there is that. But let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments. Please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you're notified the moment I post new content on my channel. And with that being said, I'll talk to you guys again very soon.